Welcome to Summon Awesome Games. Good looking people, I'm Rob. We are playing Animal Crossing Pocket Camp. Doesn't my dude look stylish? Look how stylish he is, man. He's got more style than me. And he's not even real, little jerk. We are waiting for nine and a half hours for a freaking tree. God damn, I suppose that's quicker than real life. You gotta wait years for a tree to grow. But still, nine and a half hours, that's still going. I felt like we put that on weeks ago. God damn. Damn it! Uh, we're still waiting on that last animal. One more animal to go until we have all the animals to muck around with, to play with, in not just like fun ways, not any other kind of way. Have I have I requested anything for Shovel Strike Quarry? I don't think I did. I think I messed up, man. Did I send any invites? Tell me I sent some goddamn invites. Uh, but how are you guys going? I hope you're all having a good day. And your animals are happy. Oh, we did send out invites. We need one more. I must have sent out four, or five to someone who was just a massive jerk and didn't help me in the quarry. Let's send out, I'll send out four, I'll send out four. To my most trusted allies, Morgan, Lindsay, and Vin. We all know Vin, Mr. Sleepy Eyes. Let's help. Uh, is this Tad? Let's go help Tad. Let's go feed him some bugs. Like I said, this is starting to feel like I run a zoo rather than a campsite. I'm just feeding animals. I wake up and say, like, alright, no time, feeding time. Let's go feed the frogs some bugs. What fish we got? We got anything good? I caught a, a football fish last night. I'll show you it. Eat the goddamn thing, fish. I don't even think there's food on it. It's just a little, little bob. Flounder. Perfect. How's Ariel? she of age yet? Uh, I'll show you my, my thing here. Yeah, look at this big fella. Look at him. A football fish. Oh, he's worth 30,000 bells. 30,000 bells. Isn't that, isn't that great? I could sell that if I wanted to, but I don't want to because I only got one. Let's pick up that shell. What are you going to be? It's got to be a squid, right? Squid a little lid. Catch it. You can never have too many fish. You can never have too many items until the point we reach your max item limit. In which case, yes. I suppose you could. I'll, uh, I'll agree with you there. Flounder? Or something better? It's gonna be a flounder. It's gonna be a flounder. Damn it, flounder. You don't even look like the cartoon one. Because you're an olive. You look like an olive. Alright, Tad, what's up, buddy? You just slurp at me? That is highly offensive. Keep your tongue in your mouth, you creep. Here you go. Are you wearing a dress? Can I really have this? Thanks, Rob. You are, you're a dude and you're wearing a dress. You're not wearing any pants. I'm starting to realize these animals don't really, don't really wear pants. This is possibly a nudist camp. I, I did not consider that before. Did I slurps? That's right. You want butterflies? You want three butterflies? Man. When you hit the higher levels, I don't even know if this is the higher levels, but like I said, level 36 is when we'll have all the animals out. So one would assume this is a high-ish level. When you hit the level 30s, they get greedy, man. Like three butterflies, and all I get is 100 bells. Yeah, I made your day. I made your lunch, you sneaky little mo. 200 bells, sporty essence, and wood. Beautiful, beautiful wood. We should look at what other items we want to craft. You want a whole? You want nothing but bugs, man. Feeding the frog. We'll look at what other items we got to craft to invite some different animals. Because obviously, we want to get every animal to max level at some point. That's our end goal. To max out every animal before they add more animals. And the only way to do that is to keep doing their requests. But we also want to have them invited to our campsite, or invitable to our campsite. We don't necessarily want every animal to come to our campsite, because we don't like every animal. That's, I mean, like, that sounds mean. But would I want Tad in my camp as he stretches and slurps? Probably not, man. Probably not. Let's have a pick. Let's have a look. Uh, Lily kind of breaks my flow of invitable animals here, so what the hell do you want, Lily? What do you want? You want a green chair? You want a green counter? I'll make it for you. Unless it's... That's alright. I can make that. I'll put that on request. I'll get Cyrus to make that. How long is it going to be? I'm betting two hours. 
I could have checked, but I didn't think of doing that before I clicked it. Show me two hours. Can I scroll? No, I can't scroll. Damn it. The suspense. Place your bets. Who's got three? Do I hear three? Do I hear four? Oh man, it knows. It knows I want to know. God damn it. Why you do this to me, game? The suspense. We'll never know. I was very tempted to leave that whole loading in there just to build the suspense, but I figured no one wants to see that. And if anything, it's a horrible thing to do. One minute 40, so that's okay. It was a two minute job, which is uh, the standard around these parts. That doesn't make sense. That's not good. I shouldn't say that. Uh, let's go with the green wardrobe. That's not bad. These are low, because Lily is, a, is an easy... <laughs> sounds mean. She's an easy frog. So, to make her stuff, to get her to come... To our campsite is uh, it's not very expensive to get her just dig that hole just got bigger that's that whoa okay um maybe we just maybe we just don't talk for like 30 seconds we just do this we just put these things on craft and we just let it let us do its own thing 30 what no I'll craft it anyway but I noticed that Lily, once you once you woo her to maximum, or almost maximum, to 15, once she hits 15 of your relationship level, she spouts out a little frog. It sounds... That's not the best wording I know. Can you imagine if someone had a kid, and that was how the doctor described it? Oh yeah, she spouted out a child. She spouted out a boy! Uh, yeah, here we go. Uh, I think she's a craft. A lucky frog. Ah, oh, isn't that sweet? Twinsies. It's like Siamese frogs. Not Siamese. Conjoined frogs. They still call them Siamese? I don't know. I just know Siamese as cats. From Lady and the Tramp. Your item has arrived. Green counter. Look at that. We got some items in there. Not only did we get a counter, we got things in the counter. I don't know what they are, but I'm sure they're, they're kind of kitchen-y looking. Alright. You want some more? You want to use some more of my wood? Goddamn frog. How much wood do you need this time? It's a table. It's a, probably the biggest one. It's not. Three and three. I accept your uh, terms and I'll build it. How long for the big one though? That's got to be three hours, right? If these are two to three minutes, that one had to be three hours. I didn't check. Oh, we're going to check now. Oh, it's an hour. Alright, we can live with that. We can live with that. Then we'll finally have uh, Lily done. We should just start ticking these off as we go. Get Lily done, then we get Chrissy done. What does Chrissy want? Polka dot stuff. A cup of tea. She just wants me to make her a cup of tea. I'm pretty sure they're at the campsite for free. Don't need me to make them for you. So, you are done, Tad. Cha-ching. What do you want, Piggy? You want some uh, yellow perch? You want some yellow perch. What about you, Chubbs? You want fruit? That's good. Healthy. On the diet. I like that. I like that. You want a shell? Good thing I picked up that shell. I might pick up another shell. Whoop, 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 whoop. I just want to see people. What do you want? What do you want? What do you want? None of you guys want anything? You want squid? I got a lot of squid. You want fruit? Easy. Done. Grab another shell. We'll see what is for sale with our little man. Is it a man or is it a woman? Uh, still miscellaneous friend over here. What's up, friendo? Martin! Man! Mr. Man Martin. There we go. What do you got? What do I need? Yellow perches. You got yellow perches for me, son? You got crap, man! No offense. I'm sorry. I shouldn't say that. Uh, you do have a rainbow trout for five? But if I were to buy that for five, I'd probably try and sell it for six. So I'm only making a thousand bucks there. And if I fail, I lose a thousand bucks. A lot of people don't, aren't buying my stuff anymore. Very saddening. People have, people don't want the rares anymore. Don't want the snappers. Don't want the beetles. They will. They'll come crawling to me at some point. They'll be like, oh my god. I need a, a rainbow trout. I need a tuna. Oh, I can't catch one. I'm gonna... I need it. And then I'm gonna be like, ha 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 Money, 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 money. Alright, who are we gonna see? Let's go to the campsite. Let's knock off these little freaks. Sounds me. I should stop calling them freaks. Animals. Adorable little animals. 
I should say knock off. That sounds like I'm in the mob or something. From the man of Boo, this place just screams picnic. It doesn't anymore. Because uh, we got rid of that picnic. Hey Goldie, what are you playing? What are you strumming? And to what do I owe this pleasure, Wolf? I have a shell for you. Congratulations, you got a shell. What do you what do you do with them? What do you do with them? It's a bit nerdy, but I'm so proud of my shell collection. Ah! Show me! Here we go. I asked, I may as well get shown. Beautiful shells. Look at them. You got coral in there. You've got the conch shell. Uh, you've got you got two other ones, which I don't believe we can pick up yet, which have not been around. So maybe they'll add them. It'll help you complete your collection. Though you probably get, you got a ton of doubles. What do you got for me? It's gonna be a long time before you get to level 14, Goldie. And you're gonna hit that sweet level 15. And at level 15. Is level 15 your max? I think it is. Level 15 is when they give us the uh, the photo frame, but I thought it was level 20. Let's have it. Let's double check. Let's check it out. Let's suss it out. What do we get at 15? Because we get that shirt. Do I have to craft that harpsichord? Oh, it's, yeah, it is level 20. So I get nothing at 15. Level 20, we get the picture. Which makes you go, why? Why? Why do you want that? What do you want the picture for? And I'm not going to craft that harpsichord until I get 1 billion pieces of wood and can afford the goddamn thing. Hey, hey your campsite is pretty cool, you know? Do the kids still say cool or is that not cool anymore? Bye, I don't care. I'm old and I have money. And I'm giving some of it right now. I like Butch. Butch just became my new best friend. He's old and has money. He gave me 500 bells. You can stay, Butch. You feel free to do whatever you want around here. If you want to harass anyone, I don't mind. You got money. In today's society, you can get away with that. Well, you could get away with it. It's uh, Times are changing. Butch will be on the, on the front page of Reddit next year. All these animals are going to have stories. Oh, you were so close, Bo. You were so close. Goldie, I gotta finish you. I gotta ask you how you are. Tell me a story. Oh, lunchtime. I better fuel up, so I've got enough energy for another afternoon of fun. You don't want to see me hangry, Rob. I don't. I want to see you level 14. Punchy is asleep or passed out. What can I do for you today? It's a solid catchphrase. Have some fruit. Wake you up, buddy. Just looks drunk all the time. You got something for me? Let's see what it is. I feel like he's the kind of guy who would get angry if you got him something he didn't want. Like if you gave him fruit, he could just snap and be like, Fruit! I don't want goddamn fruit! What do I want fruit for? And just start hurling bottles at the wall. But that's punchy for you. He's a character. He's a rascal. You know when he, he gets in his car accident after he's been drink driving and hits a tree and everyone says the nice things about him. Oh, you know, he was a rascal. He was just a, he was a lad. He was a good lad. Oh, he's the life of the party. Everyone loved him. He was so much fun. It's just BS, man. Everyone hates Punchy. Passed out on the drums. Eloise, what's up? What are you drinking there? That swirly coffee? I got a swirly coffee. I'm going to drink it right now. Mmm. Mmm. I was I was saying mmm myself. I was not reading that. Mmm. There's something. There's nothing better uh, than just sitting and relaxing with a fresh cup of coffee. Correction. A magazine or eight could be added to the equation. Yeah, it depends on the magazine. Do you know what? In Australia, right? This is all right. If you're an Australian, here's a massive magazine secret. The government doesn't want you to know. It sounds like a conspiracy theory, like I'm a nut job, like Punchy, but it's true. If you are a library member, I'm going to get in close here and whisper this one to you. I don't want the world to know it. But if you're a library member, right? If you're a member of the library in Australia, you can get magazines for free. I'm not talking go into a library and pick up a magazine and borrow it or read it in, a mag in, the, in the library. I'm talking, you get your tablet, right? You go to your library's 
website or the, the Australian Library website you, end, you find your little magazine thing you look up magazines and they have this app I'm not kidding they have an app where you log in as your library account and like signing up for a library I think it's like two bucks or free I don't know like I've had a library card since I was a child and I could still use it for this and you get this app and you can download any magazine onto your tablet like as because you know how like let's say Google Books or something they have Google Books or Google magazines you can buy a magazine and read it on your tablet but you gotta pay like the price the magazine costs uh, and just have it digitally so you can get like digital magazines like you get digital books or whatever you can get them for free and the government will pay for it I'm not even kidding so we have this app I'm talking like if you want to get the latest uh, Game Informer, Xbox Magazine, Empire Magazine, Cooking Magazine, whatever magazine comes out, you can download for free and just have it on your tablet as if you bought it and read it when you want. I'm not kidding here. It is the greatest thing. It's the biggest secret of the library people. It's amazing. I'm selling... I'm. I'm selling you on this. I hope I'm selling you on this because you gotta get in on it. Go to your library website, look up about magazines, and you can have all your magazines. So I like every month. I used to buy like Empire magazines. They're like ten bucks. Game Informer. I think Game Informer is pretty cheap. So it's like five bucks. Uh, and then Mel would get her baking magazines or whatever. And then you can get like Photoshop magazines. I'm talking like you know if you've ever done Photoshop, they're like thirty dollar magazines. That's thirty dollars Australian. They're not cheap magazines. So if you want any of them, National Geographic, whatever it is, uh, they're free, goddammit, and you can download them on your tablet, or your phone, or whatever, for free. Blew my mind. When I was showing it, I was like, what, how, this, the, how? How does this, this makes no sense. It's true, it's true, all of it, I'm not kidding. Do it, look it up, look it up. It's the greatest secret in the world of the library people. The librarians don't want you to know. It's their big secret. And be like, ha, ah, wow, how did you learn to bake that fancy cake? Ah, oh, you had to buy the magazine. Wow, you must buy a shit ton of magazines. Oh, yes, says the librarian. I buy all the magazines. Any magazine that comes out, I read it. I buy them all. Thousands and thousands of dollars worth of magazines. For free, mother effers. Do it. Look it up. That's my fellow Australians. Look it up. I'm sure other countries might have something similar. I don't know why this is not a commonly known thing. Blows my mind. I like that we're just like autopiloting this Animal Crossing gameplay. It's just I've just done it so much. I was I was barely even looking at the screen. I just know what I'm doing. Amazing, right? How are we doing? What did you want? You wanted fruit. Of course you wanted fruit. You're on a diet. Here you go. Have some fruit. Leaf is here, that little freak. Little freak Leaf. I don't think Leaf is a real person. If they are, they're scaring the shit out of everybody in their game. Got some cotton. Thank you very much, Biddy. What level are you at? You're level 7. That's pretty good. Have some more fruit. Oh, I stick into the diet. Didn't ask for like a chocolate bar or something. A candy coated butterfly. I like you, Biddy. You're growing on me. Oh, uh, how thoughtful of you. You're damn right. I, we're in this together. You and me. 300 bells, some wood, some cotton. Ah, oh, you're the best. I'll make it up to you soon, promise. What else do you want? What is your last request? Fish. A healthy fish. You can have some healthy fish. It's good for you. Granny, you are having three of them. And... You, start, you got like a... One's like a starter. You got the little starter horse mackerel. And then you've got uh, the sides of the squid, and then you got the mains of the flounder. At least you didn't ask for dessert, right? Good girl. Three hundred bells, two cotton. You're a cotton giver, hey? My favorite kind of people, because we need a ton of cotton right now. Uh, what I like about having like the cotton thing. Don't do this to me. Why are you doing this to me today? Why are you doing this to me? I'm trying to talk about cotton. Anyway. What I was going to say before we interrupted again, title screen again, um, is I like the cotton givers because if we focus on getting the cotton 
and then making these tents and stuff with the cotton by the time it comes to making the amenities that need steel or whatever it is whatever <laughs> what else is that steel and wood and i don't know steel and wood by the time we need to make them we'll have so much of it we'll just make them we'll just be like ah yeah whatever we'll make that we got a ton of cool essence we got a ton of sporty essence by, by focusing natural essence and i think we're doing cute we'll be laughing when it comes to finishing off the other two uh but that is the end i don't i'm sick of these tile screen pop-ups why are you doing this to me these unexpected errors that have occurred terrible man one day i'll see my friends request list again maybe possibly because a lot of you guys who have apks are probably going to start going you know i don't want to keep downloading apks to update my game i'm just going to start again fresh when it comes out in my country uh so all your friend requests all the friends that i have in my list are probably going to start their own separate game again anyway so i'm gonna be stuck with these empty accounts that can't help me and i'll be sad i'll be the f i'm gonna have the most friends who are dead they're dead friends Thank <laughs> you.